Hi, hey, and all those other greetings for adventurers. I'm GX Bins, welcoming you guys back to my gaming and unboxing channel, where today we have a very festive boxing for all of you guys today. So basically, I made an order on the uh, the Pokemon Center website that I'm very excited for. And you know what? I have very rarely dressed up for any Christmas stuff. And I don't know when this is going to go up, but considering it's Christmas themed, uh, I'm going to want to try to get it in December. And hopefully uh, we have absolutely no issues. But again, not talking about that stuff. But anyway, though, if you guys don't know, uh, the Pokemon company Game Freak, they ended up posting three holiday plush. And they usually do for certain holidays. And I actually have one of those holiday plush in a box. I also have um, something else in here for a later video, but I'm very excited for this one. But I need to tear this open. Why does that look like... Oh, okay. I was like, why does that look like a score bunny foot? Because <laughs> that's not what I ordered. Um, almost surprised they don't do Christmas versions of the starters, but I mean, they did just have the starters be sold. Uh, but anyway, though, we have what my mom has dubbed Charmandier. That's right. It's festive. It's Christmassy. It's cute. And believe it or not, this is my first Charmander plush. Um, I don't have Bulbasaur. I do have a Squirtle, but yeah, I don't have one of these guys. And what is more festive than a fire type? You know, it's super cold outside. His tail is on fire, so he's keeping warm. And not only that, he's dressed like a cute little deer. Like, this is so adorable. And honestly, I've never been the biggest fan of Charmander. Don't throw me out of a window for saying that. Um, Ch Charizard is my favorite out of those final starters. Um, but I've always personally liked Squirtle the most, to be honest. But Charmander, he's... he's endearing <laughs> you're either gonna want to throw me out a window because of what i said about uh charmander or because of my, my dear puns let's take a nice hot chocolatey look at this cute little not red nosed pokemon <laughs> so first things first he has these little antlers on the top of his hood which are just Super, super cute. And these are actually also attached to the ears. Oh, no, they're not. Okay, they were just so close together that they looked attached. And uh, is this the first time in history that Charmander has ears? That's insane. But they're not real. <sighs> okay, that was stupid. <laughs> but yeah, just like um, the other plush, I believe the same thing for the Alolan Vulpix back there. There is a hood on this, so it does actually go up and down, you know, just, just in case. Maybe you, uh, that's, why is that actually cuter? <laughs> why is it, why is him with the hood down actually more adorable? That's so weird to me. But yeah, we have it up. It's still really cute. All right, now that they're actually propped up, yeah, that, that's still really cute. Um, but going more so into this, you do have the antlers, which are fairly soft. And they have these little yellow, uh, these little yellow dots on the top of the antlers, which I'm honestly not sure why that's there, because it's not like antlers have lights on them or something. But, I mean, it's still a really cool, nice little thing. Kind of like, you know, maybe Santa has his lights going and they're hitting the reindeer. Or maybe just to light up the way, or because he's a fire type and he has fire shooting through his hoodie. That would also be really, really cool. Um, just like a bunch of other Pokemon plush, you do have very many different fabrics on here. Like, for instance, the hood itself is a very, very different fabric. Very thin, but also very nice. And then, of course, inside is uh, is a different fabric as well, being a little rougher. And then the, uh, the skin, that's actually really soft. You'd think a, a reptile would have some pretty scaly skin, I know it's a plush, and having like a scaly Pokemon type of texture really wouldn't make much sense, 
Also, he's been shown to be more smooth, except for the, the actual, like, Detect Pikachu movie. Well, you know it's Christmas because uh, my allergies are awful. <laughs> but uh, back into the fabrics, you do have this, and oh my god, the top is not soft at all, but the bottom of this, this is really soft. Oh my god, this is, this is freaking soft as heck. Yo, can... <laughs> Can we just reverse that, please? I don't care if it looks good. <laughs> it's just, this is way softer than that. I'm telling you. If you have one of these, just pick it up and just rub the little bottom of it because it feels so nice. That's so satisfying. Guys, I know this probably just seems really drawn out right now. But right now, this is relaxing. Who needs fitness or relaxing music when I can just pet the hoodie of a charming dude? But uh, moving on from that, so we don't have a weird 15-minute <laughs> video of me just petting the, the bottom of that, you've got his bell right under his little shining toddler teeth with uh, a little mistletoe, I'm guessing. So hopefully nobody uh, falls right in front of him, because if they do, they're going to have to get a fire fang to the face. Right? That's, that's romance. <laughs> When you're when you're a start when you're a, um, a first evolution Pokemon, that basically is romance is biting. Um, that sounded worse than I. Wow, wow. Okay, mm. uh, great spins, great. This is why you need more sleep. <laughs> anyway, though, uh, moving on, you do have the uh, this diamond because everybody knows with deer. They have diamonds on their chest, which is why they're with Santa, because he wants to get rich. Well, it's not that he wants to get rich, it's that he has to keep rich so that he can give all of the uh, good boys and good girls the presents, which is why, uh, even though coal is very expensive. Oh, he just doesn't turn them into diamonds. <laughs> and then he just throws them into people's stockings. He's like, oh. Yeah, you punched your sister three days before. Have some coal. It's okay. It'll it'll save me some production costs. You know he's gotta gotta keep with that magic dust. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really don't know why they chose a diamond there, but it does look really nice. Uh, works very well for him. Although, it probably would have looked nicer had they had like, cause Charmander actually has that regular like tan part going down um if you look on that tail it has this type of part all on and deers are like that too so if they would have done that it would have fit with the style of a deer and well this charman deer but hey you know i guess they're trying to uh say some pokemon lore here <laughs> on the back though we do have some accuracy because we have three little dots so if you uh throw him and, okay, I rolled a three. Um, okay, okay, you know what? Moving through your Mario Party. Uh, that's, that's actually, that's actually pretty bad. Um, what about, what about my other roll? Uh, diamond. What's a roll of three in diamond? Can somebody tell me? Is that a good thing? <laughs> um, or three of diamonds. It's, it's a playing card. There you go. <laughs> Going from there, though, something that I've been holding off talking about is the fire tail. Which is a really, really cool way of doing fire. Seriously, they made it like this really soft, fluffy type of thing. Kind of like, you know... Ow, I hit myself. <laughs> kind of like a puffball. Just, this is a bad example because it's glittery. And I got it for like $5. <laughs> um, but you've got the red here and you've got the yellow here and it's super, super fluffy. Um, could they have done it a little bit better? Technically, yes, but honestly, I really like the look of it because it actually looks like real fire, and half the time, companies that try to do real fire on plush, they just kind of do, like... Is there is there really any other than Pokemon, now that I think about it? I really don't think of any company that would even need to. <laughs> um, if you guys have any examples, let me know. I don't even know why I'm thinking that. 
But uh, yeah, he does, of course, have a... Oh, it's not a hoodie. It's a onesie. Um, he does have a hole for his tail. So that's good. He can at least have some breathing room. Which, if he did it, then his costume probably would have caught on fire. And that would have just sucked. Um, but then you also do have... Um, you know, his little, his little cuffs and then the, these little bottom hoof type of things, which keeps him, I'd say nice and warm, but he's already kind of warm. So you can't help but feel bad for him. And of course you do have his little feet with his little polka paws and then his little polka claws. <laughs> and those, those claws are just, uh, really thin pieces of fabric, which that works pretty well. And then, of course, the footprints right there. Just, you know. It, it's nice that they add that, because they really, really don't have to add that. And then, looking at the tag... The tag art is so cute! Oh my god! Oh my god. Just buy it for the tag art, guys. Just buy this plush for the tag art! Yo! That's so nice. Oh my god. Pokemon Company. You guys are awesome. Um, but if you guys are wondering, because there's, as I said, there's usually more plush that come in here. And I know I was gushing the whole time, uh, but I'm sure you guys will, <laughs> will appreciate that because you guys like when I'm happy. And I like when I'm happy because being happy is like, yeah, being happy is like this. It's just amazing. Um, but if you're wondering what the other Christmas 2019 Pokemon plush are, you've got, of course, Charmander. You've got a Christmas Sylveon, which is kind of like the Vulpix with the whole red hoodie and snowflakes. And I thought of getting that one, but Charmander is too endearing. Did I use that one already? I think I used that all already. Hmm. I don't have any more deer puns. <laughs> I'm all out. Um, but then you also have this, like, Father Time Pikachu with, like, a white mustache and just in a bunch of, like, this white cloak. And I just, I didn't like the look of it. And also, I think we can all agree I have a fair amount of Pikachu already. <laughs> Even though I like Pikachu, um, there's a lot of Pokemon. And I want to make sure that I keep getting other Pokemon so that my collection doesn't just end up being kind of... Well, see, the difference is, though, the Pikachu ones, because it's by the same company, even though these guys do an amazing job, like, please don't stop making these, because you guys just do freaking awesome. Um, but the Pikachu plush, because of that, they're all the same style, whereas the Sonic ones are at least very different styles. Um, so that's also a huge reason to get more, more Pokemon, and also so we can add to my Pokemon village back there. Because that's always nice. But anyway though guys. If you liked this video and feel in the Christmas spirit. Don't even know where that came from. Feel like I'm advertising Frosted Flakes or something. But if you guys are feeling in the Christmas spirit. Make sure to hit that like button. Share this out with all your. Um, I was about to say something else that could be taken. Very. Very badly um <laughs> share us out with all of your Christmassy and holiday loving friends and uh yeah let me know what you guys think of the christmas p uh, i almost said pikachu the christmas pokemon <laughs> and hopefully in the next video i won't be stumbling over my words or 11 other deer <laughs> also let me know your best deer puns because i only had two. Kind of, kind of sad. But it's time to fly off. So keep your hoofs safe. That that got really awkward at the end. It's been a while since I've done unboxing, so I should have gone like whoosh or something. Like what? What did the deer sound like when they're, when they're flying in the air? Because, I mean, it's not like their hoofs hitting the air would make sound. So I guess I I couldn't really have gone. I, I feel like I couldn't make a hoof sound without 
sounding like an idiot, though. Alright, alright, well. Bye, guys. <laughs>